If you suspect that your Mac is running too hot and therefore affecting its performance, you can quickly get a basic check on your Mac's current thermal pressure in the terminal application. To do this, navigate to Spotlight in the top right of your desktop and type Terminal into the Spotlight search window that appears. Press Enter or click on the Terminal app in the list and Terminal will open in a new window. Next, copy and paste the Terminal command that I added in the description using Command C and Command V respectively. Or just type sudo space powermetrics space hyphen s space thermal. Press Enter on your keyboard and you will be prompted for your admin password. You will not see anything as you enter your password, but once you're done, press enter on your keyboard and it will then display your thermal pressure after a few seconds. It will also keep updating every few seconds. Ideally, the pressure is nominal, as you can see here, but there are several different states, each with a description of the impact. Nominal, with no noticeable impact. Moderate, minimal impact. Heavy, system performance is impacted with fans running at maximum speed and trapping, which indicates that the computer should be cooled down as soon as possible to avoid damage. These states could also be referred to as nominal, fair, serious, and critical, respectively. There is also a final state called sleeping, which I imagine means the computer is so hot it will turn off or sleep to avoid damage to its components. But these terms are used by app developers, and I'm not an app developer, so I'm actually not sure. Let's just hope you don't get to that point. An overheating Mac can be remedied in a number of ways, but checking the fans for dust, closing intensive applications, and using your Mac in a cool area out of the sun is a good place to start. I'll post a couple videos in the description that show how to find CPU and RAM usage, which might help determine what processes are currently using the most resources, and possibly contributing to your Mac's thermal state. So finally, press Ctrl and C on your keyboard to terminate the process, and then you can select Quit from the terminal menu in the top left of the screen. If you found this video helpful, please consider liking, subscribing, and maybe clicking the super thanks button below the video for additional support. Thanks.